Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Emily and I'm now moving into my second year of medical school and I wanted to make a video about how I am a sustainable student or a more sustainable student because don't get me wrong, I am not perfect, at nowhere near in fact, but I wanted to talk about how I'm trying to be more sustainable during my time at university and life in general. So in this video, there's lots of different things I want to talk about and there will be timestamps in the description so you can look at the bits you're interested in and the brands you're interested in if that's why you're here. But I wanted to make this video to talk about how I'm making an effort to be more sustainable at university. To start with, we're going to talk about some very simple things that everyone should do if they can do it because I've there are a lot of people I see walking around using plastic bottles that are single use and you bin after the first time. Now, don't get me wrong, I do not always use my own water bottle, say if I get a bottle of pop or somehow, or if I've forgotten it and I get a bottle of water. We all do that sometimes, but I do make an effort to use a reusable water bottle every time I'm in university as best I can. Whether this be a thermos one, which keeps the water cool because I hate warm water, I just hate it with a passion if you know me. So having this to keep my water cool on a university day and refill at the medical school with the water fountains is so, so useful. If you are going to University of Birmingham Medical School, the best water fountain is the one in the Wolfson Common Room and it's always the coldest water, so I highly recommend using that one. But for those aren't, who aren't, find the water fountain that you love. And then I got this plastic one, which I actually got recently because I'm part of the Commonwealth Games team. Having a water bottle like this is also really useful for like going to the gym, working out or just in general having a backup water bottle that is plastic, washable and you can see inside. Next thing is bags. I highly recommend getting a sturdy shopping bag. So these are the ones I use. They are very sturdy. They're from Asda. They are thick and they have these shoulder straps so when you're walking you carry your shopping on your shoulder and it's not as heavy. I highly recommend having at least two or three really sturdy, thick shopping bags that you take when you go and do your big shop from Aldi, Tesco, Sainsbury's, wherever you go. What I would also recommend is having tote bags. Now I have loads of tote bags, which if you watch me moving out of university video, you'll see how many tote bags I have and that it is definitely a lot. These tote bags are folded up and there are so many. There's one in every single bag I own, every single backpack, every single little satchel bag, because I will go out, I will buy stuff I don't need and I will need a bag to put it in. So having a tote bag is so useful because it can fold up small and you can put it wherever. So when you have stuff that doesn't fit in your bag, you can put it in a new bag instead of buying a plastic one. It's just little things like that, making sure you have a bag so you don't have to buy plastic ones from the shop. Now, before I move on to brands, I wanted to talk about one thing that I do that well, isn't necessarily 100% sustainable, but I am a paperless student. So I only use my iPad and my laptop. I write as little on paper as possible. I have a notebook and a couple diaries, but I tend to do everything on my iPad, on my good notes, using my Apple Pencil. Now, I am a paperless student, not because I do it for the environment. I never thought about that originally. But I like the flexibility of being able to type and draw and write and everything. And on the iPad, you can combine all of those things all into one. And it has been so good. I used it every day in medical school. Just go back and watch my vlogs. I use it every day. And it is an amazing piece of technology. It is just amazing. And being a paperless student is not for everyone. I love handwriting on the iPad, but a lot of people I know could never do that full time. So it is completely up to you. I am a paperless student, I think it makes it better for me because I could, I would have used so much paper and so many notebooks in medical school. So I'm a paperless student, not completely, but a good majority, like my whole degree is in my iPad. Now let's talk about some brands that I use. Now we've got four big mentions in this video, so I'm going to timestamp them down below and talk a little bit about them and why I use them and what other options they have available. So first things first, I'm going to talk about shaving. I do like to shave my legs and things. It's just something I enjoy to do. So that's why I wanted to invest in some sort of shaving company that uses recyclable blades. Now I found this company through a friend. So one of my flatmates, she told me about it. It is called Fuss Free Shaving. They give you this handle. So as you can see, I have my name Emily inscribed on it and it costs no extra. I think the blade, the handle itself costs about $5.95. And this is a reusable handle and every blade I get will attach to this one. 
You then simply press this button to detach the head and then you pu simply push it back down to reattach the head. So the blades are changeable. Now, on your deliveries, you'll get a little tray, a plastic tray with four blades. Now these, the handle into the blade and remove it from the packaging. So it means you won't get cut from the blades because it is in the plastic protection. And then you have a new one on. These, this subscription is completely flexible. You can change up when you use the products, how often you receive the blades. These can be based on how often you shave. So say if you shave once a, once a day, then you can get your blades more often. If you shave once every two to four days like me, you're probably not gonna need them as often and you can change your subscription. Now, after you've had the subscription for a while, you do this, get this claw travel cap, which is with the FFS logo on for free shaving. You can place your head in there and then you can keep it safe. There is a suction cup device as well that you can use to attach your razor onto the wall in the shower. This is something that is very useful. I like being able to recycle the blades. Now, leading on from this, we're gonna talk about a brand that is a little less subscription-based. So most of them are subscription-based. This is not. This is a shop that you can go to, which you probably already know as Lush. So Lush do sustainable products. They let you send back your plastic bottles and boxes and give you money off your next purchase because of it. It is fully recyclable, fully biodegradable products and they are amazing quality. I love them. So I use quite a few range. I use a range. There are a lot of products in my gallery, like my collection at the moment. I'm going to show you a couple here. So I have Twilight, which is a shower jelly, because this is quite fun. I have Honey I Wash the Kids, which is the body wash I use, which smells amazing. And I have Charity Pot. Now Charity Pot is a body lotion that I use after I've shaved with Fuss Free Shaving. And this lotion also gives money towards charity every time you purchase it and it smells amazing and it's soft. And something that I love about Lush is this little cork pot to start my shampoo bar, which is running out, which is why it's broken. Um, but shampoo bars are sent, like they're just amazing. You could use it and then it's fully gone. There is no waste, no plastic, and it's perfect. It does amazing things for my hair. I swap up the shampoo bar I use every so often. There are so many options. I will put in a couple of clips of the Lush in Birmingham right now. But Birmingham Lush is huge and has so many options. And most of the big cities in the UK do have a Lush star. So I highly recommend looking to Lush because even though it is more expensive than the typical drugstore or supermarket bar product, Lush offers a sustainable brand with natural products that do amazing things for your body and I highly recommend checking them out. I'm not somebody who thinks oh, all natural is perfect. Don't get me wrong, head and shoulders works. Tresemme work. I love Lush. Their products are so good for my skin. I've had fewer breakouts because of it. Quality, it's just, they are amazing. So if you've not tried Lush before or you've never committed to trying Lush before, I would highly recommend it. You can recycle five pots and get a free face mask or you can take them back and get 50p off your next purchase which I think is just so good for the environment and I highly recommend having a go. Now we're going to talk about the most recent addition to my sustainable student lifestyle which is a deodorant brand which you may have heard of or seen called Wild. So Wild deodorant does it come with the case which you purchase first and then you never have to purchase again. I recently got this one which is an ombre colour. It was a special event. They did it with a passion fruit, passion fruit and mango deodorant which is what I've got in at the moment which smells amazing by the way but these are little roll-on deodorants that have come in cardboard recyclable packaging that's like this and slot into this device you turn to make it up and turn it to go down but this product is amazing so far it gives you such a quality deodorant and it smells amazing and it comes on subscriptions so they refill but this is a relatively new product so I don't have a lot to say about it yet so I will do an updated video next year talking about how I got on with Wild and the brand itself but this is such a good way to try and be sustainable because the aerosol deodorants we we use them so much we don't really think about the impact they're having on the environment I've definitely gone through at least five or six this year and I know that that packaging is not biodegradable at all and it is quite damaging for the environment so Wild 
looks good on my shelf, smells amazing, and is doing the exact same job and is fully renewable and recyclable. So I highly recommend checking them out. Finally, I want to talk about Small. Small is a cleaning brand. So they provide biodegradable products that are really good for the environment and sustainable. They have such a wide range. They do washing tablets, dishwasher tablets, sponges, cloths, surface sprays, everything you can think of. They do hand sanitizer and all sorts. So these are refillable products. Now I'm gonna show you first my sprays. So this is the purple, this is the glass cleaner. We have orange, multi-surface, and then blue, which is the bathroom cleaner. Now, I do use bathroom cleaner in combination with Dettol antibacterial spray, just because I am a medical student and I do not want to risk germs, infections, and things like that. So I do use that as well. But I do tend to use these as my primary cleaners. They're the ones that I use before I wipe down any surface in any room. So these tablets, Come in a little round packet, a little paper biodegradable packet. You drop it into the bottle when it's got hot water in it and wait for it to dissolve. Fill it up a little bit more with water, put the spray in and there you go. Spray complete. So these tablets come on subscription as often as you need them. So mine come every three months in a pack of three multi-surface, two bathroom and one glass cleaner. These then get stored because these tablets can last a very long time and you can make sprays with them whenever you need them. I also have these tablets that have bio and non-bio cleaning tablets. These ones come on subscription also because I don't need to go shopping for washing things. It just comes in the post when I need it. And it is amazing. So they calculate when things come based on how much you use a product. So I would highly recommend looking into small because there are so many options and things coming on subscription just make my life so much easier. I don't have to remember to buy cleaning things. I just use them because they come when I need them. So if you've liked any of these brands or you have any questions about any of these brands, please put them in the comments below. I will leave links to all the websites and all of the different things that I have shown you in this video. I am going to do a video in my house tour showing you all the different Lush products I use. So if you want to see all the different Lush products I use, it will be in my house tour in the bathroom aspect of that video. So thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed. If you have any questions about how to be a sustainable student in 2022, please comment them down below. If you like this video, please like, comment and subscribe and I will see you next time. Goodbye.